certified most accurate. Now your TV5 first alert forecast. Well, good morning, mid-Michigan. It uh, has been a busy week for us weather-wise between the several rain and storm chances, the heat and the humidity, and yesterday we had the funnel clouds out there. Quick note about those funnel clouds. Uh, of course, uh, we do have several, several different types of rain showers, different types of storms, different types of weather systems. So just like everything else, we've got different types of funnel clouds as well. Some of them are tornadic and can produce tornadoes. Others are not. And yesterday we did not have tornadic funnel. So those funnels were out there, but you didn't get a tornado warning on your phone because they were not actually related to tornadoes. It just happens sometimes. They're called cold air funnels. They come through on cold fronts, much like what we were dealing with yesterday. And so that's the, the reason why we saw the funnel, but it didn't really uh, come out as a tornado warning or anything of that nature. Now out there for our temperatures this morning, we're starting on the cool side. 50 at Houghton Lake. If we would have pulled up this map about an hour ago, it was 47 degrees up there this morning. Lots of 40s across the far north, just outside of mid-Michigan. Most of everybody else lower to middle 50s, even a few lower 60s in there. Poor Flint uh, just now getting down to 63. They were holding on to the middle 60s for some time. Now, here's a look at our dew point. Kind of shows us how much moisture we have out there. We're looking at those uh, dew points for us in the upper 40s across the north. We've got some middle 40s to lower 50s mixed in there uh, about near the bay and south of the bay. Still holding on to the upper 50s and lower 60s. This puts us easily into the pleasant and comfortable ranges out there for our humidity today. And those temperatures warming up for us in the middle and upper. 70s as we go into the afternoon. Lots of sunshine out there as well. Just really a beautiful day for us overall. This is what the first alert pinpoint Doppler looks like for us, and there's nothing really to talk about. Some noise from the radar, but the clouds starting to move out. There's no rain moving through for us today, and the hour by hour shows us the dry conditions remaining throughout the evening hours as well. So here's where we go into the afternoon. 70s by noon going into the later uh, parts of the day. We're talking the middle to upper 70s for most folks, maybe a lower 80 sneaking in there for a brief time. And again, into the evening dry side. This is when things change for us, though. Clouds moving in overnight. Chance of showers as we go into tomorrow morning. Best chance for showers will be during the morning hours before noon and mostly for folks south of the Saginaw Bay. So that's down uh, between the bay and our border with I-69 there. And we'll have those continuing to move through and potentially even lingering into parts of our afternoon hours as well. We could even work in an isolated thunderstorm in there uh, in, into that mix, but it should be mostly uh, just uh, some steadier rain showers with a few heavier downpours in there. No severe weather is expected for us tomorrow. Seven day forecast is looking nice. We've got uh, temperatures holding in the lower 80s through the weekend as we go into Monday. Still likely on the drier side, but a small chance for rain. 85, that'll be the, the highest temperature there on our seven day. And then we cool down going through the rest of next week. But so that does come with several chances for rain. Stay with WNEM TV5 on air, on the go, and online for more news and weather updates.